Hello! Nabisha! Oh my god! Hey, gorgeous! How are you, my darling? Very well. Good, good, yes. good. You are so glamorous! <laughs> Tell us about your fiance. Dan, he's a mad scientist. He's really funny. <laughs> we met on an um, online dating app. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> one of the infamous swipey, 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 swipey. Ooh, super liked that one. <laughs> yeah. So he super liked me, and I was more inclined to meet him. <laughs> 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 Thanks. <laughs> and when you say he's a mad scientist, what do you mean he's a mad scientist? Well, he's an actual scientist. Oh, right, he's OK. Mad. Yeah. And he's mad? Yeah. Lovely. And do you work as well? I'm not working at the moment um, because three years ago I was diagnosed with cancer. I was living out in Marbella and just really enjoying life. And then I was hit with a cancer diagnosis. That changed everything. I had to immediately move back to the UK and start my chemotherapy. I lost all my hair, nails, everything. I just, uh, I just lost everything, basically. Do you mind me asking what type of cancer was it? Breast cancer. And where are we with the whole cancer treatment at the moment? Um, I'm still having treatment. OK. I've had a double mastectomy. Right. How... It, has the breast cancer changed your opinion when it comes to things like getting married and showing off your body and the type of dress you may choose? I'm finishing treatment and I just want to start next year, you know, as a brand new chapter in my life. So let's talk dresses then. OK, what are we looking for? So, obviously, due to my situation, I'm looking for a higher neckline. OK, I, I'm going to stop you there. I'm going to stop you straight away. OK. Due to your situation, you've already given yourself a limit. If you go into this believing you can only wear one type, yeah. already that whole story is right at the centre of your dress picking. True. So let's talk about the, the overall style. I think it's like proper glamazonian, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. You can see it. The eyelashes, the hair, the pink lipstick. It has to be very glam. Yeah, definitely want something that's figure hugging, um, shows off my curves. I just want to get back to being confident and sexy. You know, I've got cancer and I'm just dealing with it. Right to the edge of the podium, look at yourself in the mirror. Your body looks drop dead mm -hmm. gorgeous. Do you feel sexy in it? Yes, I do. Um, yeah, I think it looks good. Right, let's spin you around to your entourage then. I like the cut. OK. The neckline, perfect. The shape, silhouette, gorgeous. The dress, absolutely not. You can do so much more. OK. We need glitz, we need glamour, we need sass. And I don't find it in this dress. I think Manny understands my style. So for the next dress, I definitely want more bling and more of a wow factor. That was cringy. The material and everything, it was very cringy. Right. So I've got some boxes to tick, and my boxes are you've got to look the best you've ever looked in your entire life. And so I have this dress, but this is her. She is so gorgeous. But as you're going to see, this bit is exposed. Um, I'll have to see how it looks on, on the chest. I'm not okay. sure about that part. It's got a really open neckline, and I'm a bit nervous to try it on because of the challenges that I have with my body. On the count of three, one, two, three. I like it. I do like it, actually. Yeah, I like this. It's gorgeous. Like this. So much better. Now all of this is not covered. I see. You can actually see your face yeah, now. Yeah, I can see what you were saying before. It's really pretty. I like Isn't it. Isn't it? OK. I'm totally surprised by how it looks. It looks way better than I imagined. By opening up your chest plate now, my God, you can just see how beautiful you are. It's like putting a frame around a picture, whereas before we were covering the picture. But what do you think? I agree with what you said about the high neckline. This is much better, actually. Do you feel sexy? I do, yeah. Do you feel confident? Yeah. Right, Kaz, what are we thinking? 
I love this dress. Gorgeous. Mm. Absolutely. This is beautiful. Okay. It's elegant. We've got a halter neck, and that's made a big change because she never thought she'd be able to wear something like that. What I would add would be some, as you've got the glitz in the top, I'd probably bring that down to the bottom. Could do with a bit more sparkle. A bit more. I can see she's happy with the dress. She's not outstandingly excited, but there's definitely an upgrade from dress number one. I am absolutely made up that Nabisha now knows that she doesn't need to hide all of that gorgeous beauty behind that high neckline. And I have to say, for any woman who's dressing their new body after a double mastectomy, it's going to be a huge challenge. But Nabisha was a Glamazonian before, and I want her to see just how glamorous she is still. And hopefully this next dress will give her the confidence to wear any neckline she chooses, just with a bit more bling and a bit more sparkle and the most important ingredient, her self-esteem. Oh, that's just gorgeous. Right, Nabs, yes. how are you feeling? Yeah, I absolutely love this dress. It's amazing. And just over the last three, four years, is this the most confident you felt about standing there in front of the mirror and seeing your reflection? Yeah, definitely. Manny, you look a bit tearful. Yeah, I didn't think I would be, but that is just... Look in the words of Maya Angelou, phenomenal woman. You look amazing. It's absolutely flawless. I knew this is the one. This is the dress. I could just read her emotion, and usually she's got a poker face, and she was screaming yes. You wouldn't change anything about it? I wouldn't change a single thing. That really? dress is you, 100%. Are you proud of her? <sighs> I am definitely proud of you. You deserve this dress. You deserve this. Oh, getting all emotional. I think you're allowed to get emotional. Oh. Let it go <laughs> and enjoy it. And it leaves me one very important question to ask you, Nabs. Are you saying yes to the dress? Don't you like the dress? What is it that she doesn't like? It's perfect. Well... Come on, Nabisha, this is the dress. Of course I'm going to say yes! <laughs> of course! <laughs> of course I was going to say yes to the dress, it's amazing. But I thought I'd just have a bit of fun with him. Just give me a warning if you want another dress again, all right? <laughs> Love ya!